So, when I count to three, Jesus' energy will come through, and you will feel it, and you will be able to let it this energy to communicate with me. One, I'm inviting Jesus' energy to come through. Two, you're almost here. And three, hello. Hi. Is this Jesus' energy? Yeah. Welcome, and thank you for coming through. And we're very excited to speak with you. And do you have any messages for the humanity, for us, or for me? What was the answer? Yes. I was trying to tell everyone they were not ready. They're not what? They were not ready. But they will be. Yes. There's always hope. Do you come to this room sometimes? No, never. No, and it's first time. No. So what are you working they on? They don't call me very often. No. So we can call you. I guess yes. Yes, I will definitely、uh, invite you more often. And let's say I like to do some workshops, and I will do this type of hypnosis in front of people, and I will invite you to channel through this body. And for you to give us some messages, can I do that? Yes. Very good. And I, very thankful. Maybe、um, this way. Yes. Can spread more love. Yes. The way I wasn't able to. I want to do this very badly. I don't even know what to ask. So when you were on Earth, what you were teaching? Love.、Mm. Tell us more. How we can feel love. That we all have deep inside of us. Let ourselves free、mm. from the worries, from past responsibilities, distractions.、Mm-hmm. Let's be pure.、Mm-hmm. Just trust, give, help, selfless. The more we, you give, the more you get. But how about to people that who are hurting us, who don't like us? Have sympathy because they're suffering through their hatred. Send love.、Mm. Light,、mm-hmm. healing. Put、mm-hmm. your thoughts. Your thoughts are very powerful. I have a very di- difficult one person right now. Name is Elena, and she's. I would say she's lost, and she's hurting herself by attacking people, like me, and another person I work with. So, what is the best way to deal with this kind of、uh, situation? We care for her very much. You can see that. Think the best for her. Believe the best for her. There's much that can be done from a distance. So much what? That can be done from a distance. Think, feel, so it delivers to her. You can repeat one more time. I have a hard time hearing you. Think, feel. Hmm. Okay. So it delivers to her. Ah,、uh, and that will help her. Yes. When you're suffering, they should not be suffering. So why someone like her will? Hurt herself to this degree. She has given up on herself.、Mm-hmm. She is a lost soul. If she doesn't evolve when she leaves her body, she will join the lost souls. Can you say it one more time? When she leaves her body, she、mm-hmm. will join the lost souls. I see. So the lost soul is not with her right now. She is the lost soul unless she evolves. But it's still up to her. Yes. Mm-hmm. Starts with her consciousness、mm-hmm. and travels down to her subconsciousness. It's how human body works on Earth. So can you explain this part one more time? So we are not very familiar with this concept. The conscious mind makes the calls. Yeah. For subconscious to follow, starts from the consciousness. Yeah. You direct it to the way that's best for you. Otherwise, it will take on its own. So、um, I'm a kind of confused more and all. So the conscious mind is from the the physical mind, but you say the conscious mind makes the call, and then、uh, for the subconscious mind to follow. No, I thought it was the other way. It can be both ways, but for ones that are not tapped into their subconscious mind, their consciousness is so active and ruling, then it. Consciousness should be redirected so it reaches the conscious. So the subconscious can change because subconscious changes the inner patterns of oneself. Changes the inner patterns. Yes. So can you tell us more about inner pattern? Inner patterns are the ones that draw experiences to us, the consequences to us. If your subconscious believes in worse, then 
it's the way you're like, oh, oh. I'm still lost. So the subconscious is in control. What makes uh, this uh, inner patterns? What's most repeated in a conscious mind is imprinted into your subconscious mind. So then the subconscious roots everything deeply and it draws experiences to you without you even realizing. But let's say when we are doing this kind of a hypnosis session, uh, the person's the person's conscious mind is meeting or is leading to the sub subconscious mind. The person is connected with the subconscious mind. Is that right? During sessions, conscious mind becomes quiet. Mm -hmm. There's no thinking mm -hmm. involved. Right. It's just feeling. Right. So the subconscious mind will come out. Will be. Yes. It's most present. I see. The way it comes out, it's the way it's been programmed. So let's say the past life. Can I say they were stored in the subconscious mind or mm -hmm. imprinted? Yes, it's not imprinted from consciousness. It's just always there with the soul. And the soul, not in us, is outside of us. We are inside of the soul, the body. Can you say it's that? It's outside of us and it is inside of us. It is. Mm. But it's energy. Yes, so what's inside of us is exposed outside of us. So, the one you say so that. It's energy around us. Oh. The universe is on the inside. That's in the inside. So did you? I'm just curious, I learned a lot today. So when you were teaching on Earth, did you? You were teaching this type of things? I wanted to teach love, but many did not understand. I was not able to teach. You were not able to? Yeah. Mm. Especially concepts like these, because they're outside of human understanding. Right. But it's important to know. Now I think humans have evolved just to have to understand everything both on the surface level mm. and deeper level. What you just said like, about the soul is the energy inside of us, but that energy will be exposed to outside. It shines outside. Say one more time. It's on the inside mm. and then it shines from inside to outside. So it's both. Mm, I see. So it's never just around you. Right. So let's say different people have a different aura or different color of energy they carry. It's because of that. Yes. You can see, let's say, right now, let's say, if someone is in the room, you can see that energy. Let's say, my energy. With colors. You can see color. Not very much. Energy inside of this body is very strong. Oh, what does that mean, strong? Intense. Is that a, in a good way? Yes. Mm -hmm. So intense that it's difficult for me to see beyond. Oh. This body is not used to this. I'm used to your energy. So, but the body can get used to it. Yes. Very good. Yeah, because I was not sure, but I want to give a try. Mm. But you said intense. It's, it's a good thing. Or she needs to be more relaxed. It's in a good way. Uh huh. It's just due to the body. Uh huh. So it's very intense compared to her uh -huh. natural energy. Oh, I see. So it's hard for me to get beyond this. Okay. Maybe next time you can maybe she can do better. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Very good. I learned so much and I feel so far no one talk about this kind of concept is deep that we need to know. It's deep and it's in everyone's deep knowing to get out of mm -hmm. the layers that have been formed. Yes. We have many layers. Yes, break through the layers. So I heard that you are coming back to Earth. Mm -hmm. I heard 2080, something around that time. Nothing much changes. But you, you're gonna appear in a different form mm -hmm. or similar? Not too different. So people can recognize you? Yes. Uh -huh. So what's the purpose of coming here this time? I know join with the ones with the same purpose, spread love, mm -hmm. to unite with them, help them. Mm -hmm. And this time you think a human will be more ready than ever? Yes, mm -hmm. really believe in the best, regardless mm -hmm. of how everything looks right now mm -hmm. on Earth. Very good. And I'm sure I'm going to invite you more often in the future. 